Space Cadet Krig here for instantaneous single target elimination. Nothing beats the orbital rail cannon strike. However, for continued damage output and flexibility, the Eagle 110 millimeter rocket pods will allow for multiple targets to experience Liberty's wrath much more frequently. The rail cannon has about three and a half minute cooldown when fully upgraded. This means that in a standard mission, you can only use this stratagem at most 11 times, since you will be saving it only for high priority targets. On the other hand, the Eagle rocket pods are able to be used up to three times in a row before Eagle 1 will need to be rearmed. If unneeded, send Eagle 1 to rearm early with a further 10% reduction in reload time with the proper ship module. The rocket pods can one-shot nearly everything on the bot front, aside from the factory strider, which neither stratagem accomplishes in a single strike. There are some inconsistencies in damage, so be prepared to finish off high-value targets another way, like the Eats, Commando, or Quasar Cannon, or just call her down for a more precision liberty. Try to throw the stratagem towards exposed weak points on heavier targets, like tanks. Don't sleep on Eagle One's ability to destroy elevated cannon turrets and fabricators. On the bug front, while it doesn't one-shot like the rail cannon does, the rocket pods may be used to break the Bile Titan's armor, making it vulnerable to things like the grenade launcher and other explosive weapons. The Impaler may also be eliminated quickly by throwing your stratagem and then shooting it in its disgusting face. Helldivers need to be aware that overhanging trees can limit the effectiveness of all Eagle stratagems. AA guns on the bot front can also prevent Eagle strikes or even damage Eagle 1, forcing her to return to the Super Destroyer for repair. Oh